This is the 21 acrylic red bone. Comes in buzzer too. All right, this one is black pearl with a stainless band. One of the options that we're going to have this year is uh, selecting the selecting a stainless, a black, a brass, or a black with uh, laser engraving on it. Pick your band. Okay. And one thing about this one is it converts. You can jump it back and forth from single to double if you get the urge to do it. All right. And while you're doing that, you can clean it. Makes it easy to clean, easy to put back together, get it back just like it was when you took it out of the little yellow package. Okay, it's an easy blowing deal. It runs one hand or two. Alright. So let's convert. Pull the barrel off of it. This is brass option. Brass tone board. A double read. Look at the little marks on the tone board. See where the face of the wedge is? It's on the mark that's closest to the insert. That's the double read mark. Okay? Double read, mark closest to the insert. Okay, so let's swap it into uh, let's swap it into a, a single. I take one of these or something like it. Put it in the back of the put it against the back of the wedge. Now you can push it out of there, but I just think it's easy just to tap it, pop it, let it come out. Okay. Take your black wedge off. Take the top reed off. Get your blue wedge. The blue wedge, the single reed wedge. Put it on the tone board against the stops. Read against the stops. Wedge against the stops. Can't you right here? So it all goes in there together. And look in that insert. You see that brass line gut pocket? Oh yeah, you can do a lot of stuff because of that. Plus I like it ain't gonna be no splitting involved. I mean you gotta be scared of tearing something up because if you want to juke around with your call, I mean that's gonna protect it. Plus, I really, really like the sound of uh brass lined gut pockets. Alright. Put the wedge in there, slide it up to that front mark. Or, man, you might be, you mean, you may want to blow it like this. <laughs> All right, you may want to put your barrel on it and just see what one read against the, or against the other mark sounds like. <laughs> or not. All right, and, uh, all right, so move it on up there to that front mark. And while you're doing it, while you're swapping it like this, good time to clean it. You know, you hunt on the ground, you're going to get dirt in it, silt in it cold crackers whatever all right when you get it on that front mark hold it like that push them in there together to tighten it brass line gut pocket feel free to push on it a little bit put the barrel back on give it a little run with one hand <laughs> two hands <laughs> okay and just blow it as hard as you want to Okay, can't overblow it. Put the power on it. Reach out there and get them a little bit. All right. So now it's in, now it's a single. Okay, so let's do it. And put it back in double. Pull the barrel off of it. Put whatever in there. You could push it out if you wanted to. I just think tapping's easier. Tap it out. Let your top read. Put them both against the stops. Get your double reed wedge, your black wedge. Everything against the stops. Push them into that brass lined gut pocket. Okay. Ease it up there on that mark. What you're doing is you're floating the wedge while you're floating the wedge on the tone board while the reed stays the same. All right. Put it on that mark. And hold them, to, hold them at the same time. Push them there until it gets tightened. Okay, now it's back as a double. And that's all there is to it. All right, now the marks that are on the tone board. 
I, I put those on there when I got the call tuned like I like it. All right, now you you can use those marks to get back to zero if you take it apart or whatever, you know, so that you can get it just like it was when it came out of the package. But you may not like it right on those marks. And if you don't, you can just use the marks that are there and remember how far off you are, or you can get something sharp and mark the wedge position that you like on it. Okay, that way you got them both memorized. I mean, it just it's obvious what happens. Okay, so let's swap it again. Against the back of the wedge, you can push on it or tap it or whatever you want to do. Take your black wedge off. Top read off. Read against the stops. The blue wedge. Against the stops. Hold it like this. Push it into that brass lined gut pocket. Slide the slide the wedge under the I mean, slide the tone board under the wedge or other float the wedge out to that mark, to your single mark, which is the one in front. Hold them together, tighten it up. Put the barrel back on it. Give it a little run. It's just that hard. And of course, you know, it makes it easy to clean it, easy to take it apart, easy to tune it. You don't have to be afraid of anything. Don't be afraid to juke with this. Now, if you don't want to mess with it, you take it out of that yellow, yellow package pot and it's going to be right, I promise. All right? I think you're going to like them. They came out really, really good. That gut, that brass line gut pocket is the thing. And being able to convert just makes it that much more. So, I mean, Find out for yourself whether you like double or single. Here you go. This is what you can test it with. The 21 Red Bone. Today is the 17th of uh, September. I'm assembling calls right now. They're updating the website. I'm going to guess by about, I don't know, the 20th. Um, they'll be ready for sale. You can go to the website and uh, on the home page at the bottom, there's a place where you can put your name and email address and you'll receive a mass email about when they really go out, or you can just keep checking back either one. But uh, I think you're going to like this conversion deal and choosing. We have a lot of options here. Of course, you can get in plastic goods too. 21 acrylic red bone.